Welcome to another episode of Burn Peak Express. This is our second channel where we do things a little different, but kind of the same. This here is my new drone. It's a Mavic 2. I got it because the old one's acting a little wonky, and by a little wonky, I mean it's crashed about 40 times. I ordered this thing in September of 2016 when it was first announced. When I turn it on, it gives me warnings like, dude, don't fly this thing, you're gonna crash it. I've replaced the gimbal and camera unit twice. I can't even count how many prepared we've been through. Even though it flies wonky, it flies. It is not useful for the things we do on this channel anymore. Let's just give this thing a proper send off. I want to do all the things that I would be too afraid to do with it because I need my drone. I need it to get shots. It's a great product and that's why I got the new version of it. So let's check and see what we can do with this thing. First thing I want to try with this drone is actually something useful. Back before I injured my foot, I left a tool up on the peak of the roof. With my foot the way it is, climbing around the roof is kind of sketchy. I want to see if we can use the old drone to go get it. So what we've done is I've taken a shifter cable and a really strong neodymium magnet and attached it to our drone here. These are not made to carry payloads, but we don't really care about that. We're gonna see how it works out. We got Kevin over there. He's gonna pile up the new one. Let's see if we can even get this thing to take off straight. Okay, she's drifting a little bit, but it's got the payload. I think we can get the tool. It's almost like this thing stabilizes it. Like the thing hanging from it actually makes it fly more stable. Oh, oh okay. Here it comes, dude, I can see it coming. You can see it coming? Right, oh my God, how do I stop this from swinging? What do I look like in the other screen? Uh, you look like you're just hovering with something hanging from it. Chill. Oh, look, look, do it. Let me go down. I know, but it's drifting everywhere. And then the thing swings even more. Oh my God, this is so hard. Just relax. Okay, I'm gonna go down a little bit. Oh, oh, oh no, no, okay, oh, okay, I got it away. Okay, oh, I see it, okay. Okay. Oh, 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 now just pull forward. Oh, you're right on top of it, dude, you're like. I know, I know. You're like, I just gotta go. No, no, okay. Oh, I think I got it. I think I got it. All right, I'm gonna try and take off. Ready, can you see it? Oh, oh, I got it, I got it. Okay, now I gotta not drop it on someone's car. Wow, maybe this drill is useful after all. Okay, we're bringing her down. Come on, <laughs> oh. So that worked out great. Dude, I haven't seen this since October. It worked, so now we can use it for something else. So what we're gonna do next is probably a little sketchier because we could break two things. I have here my micro crawler. It's actually really heavy. I'm wondering if the drone is strong enough to pick it up. If it is, we could have this little here magnet on the receiver and then get it down onto the roof fly away really fast so it disconnects. So once it's released on the roof, Kevin can drive the micro crawler up to the peak of the roof. This plan already has failure written all over it. Okay. Oh, man. Oh! Okay, really smooth now. I can't even believe it's carrying that thing. I'm gonna get you on the flat area right there. Yeah, try and drive forwards. Ready? Ready? It's almost like the drone flies better with weird stuff attached. Oh, 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 That was ridiculous. Hey, let's see if we can bring it down. Hey, it's easier than attaching a real receiver. Oh my God, it's hooked on, dude. How sick is that? I just can't believe it's picking it up. We just straight military like airlifted that thing into battle. And we brought the drone back down safely and we brought my favorite little truck down safely. Man, I didn't even break it. You didn't even break it. You know what's crazy is how many of these I've broken and I didn't break it doing that. This is a resounding success. So we do it. First of all, we crank this thing open. We light it, right? Then we get the drone to pick it up, mag it to the bottom of it. Pick it up, go over to the fire pit and initiate a fire with the drone magnetic map cast lit all at the same time. No, it can't do it, it can't do it. What? We're gonna get the hammer and then we're gonna be able to hit stuff with the hammer, right? So we're gonna try with the foam first. I got another idea put like a big spike on the front of the drone, like a kitchen knife, 
and we fly it right into the dead tree, and it's gonna stick in, and the drone will just be like, like out there. Maybe we should try it with a foam block, and I think going into a tree is gonna be way more difficult. My question is gonna be is, who's gonna hold the foam block? Hold the foam block? There's something it really doesn't like. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> the knife definitely stuck in. And the drone's fine, of course, right? So I don't think that was worth it, but I think we, the what if, we know now. I think what would be really cool to do at this point, since it's probably gonna fly all wonky, we get you in a full face helmet, okay. right? Then we're gonna get you a shield, like a big garbage can lid. Okay. And I'm just gonna attack you with it, and you gotta defend yourself. I'll go with that. Yeah? That'll it. be the grand finale? Okay. Yeah. Could this be the least safe video we've ever done? This is the first time I'm flying it with the 360 cam, too. Obstacle avoidance disabled. That's how we like it. Okay. Whoa! The propeller just flew off. Back up and running. Ooh! Ooh, okay. All right, we're ready. Now twist a little bit to look at me. Oh, yeah. This is so scary, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. It's going way faster than I thought it was gonna be. I actually thought that was gonna be all fun and games, but you're saying it was actually scary? We've done a lot of dumb things, but like the drone is actually like, I mean, it's like spinning and it's loud. It's like accelerating towards you. Like, Did the trash can lid take on damage? It cracked. That's like a brute, like rubber made, like hardcore trash can lid. And it actually cracked. I mean, it hit pretty hard. Like that's a pretty big crack. I didn't think that the trash can lid could even get damaged by that. Thanks, man. Well, boys and girls, you're gonna be happy to know that the drone survived. There's supposed to be a cover on that, yeah, that camera. Yeah, that's good. No, the camera's fine. No, it's supposed to be- Oh, yeah, yeah, the glass is gone. The glass is gone in the front But it, it probably still looks fine. <laughs> we are out of propellers. We had a whole stockpile of them, and we're, they're all gone. But otherwise, I think the drone still works. What do you guys think we should do next? Do you even want to see another thing next, or is this stupid? And we know it's stupid, but. I want to figure out how we can actually light a fire with the drone. I think we get a smaller can of map gas or something that's a smaller tank with less weight. So we know what Kevin wants to do, but what do you want to see us do with this drone? I want to push it to its limits. I want to see what it can handle. Let us know in the comments what you want to see us do with this next. You may be subscribed to our main channel, but this is our second channel where we do sketchy stuff like this. So if you like this and you want to see more, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Thanks for riding with me today. I'll see you next time.